We are tonight's entertainment. Hey guys, it's Maverick here. Welcome back to another Five Nights at Freddy's mashup multiplayer. Today we're doing the last character for Five Nights at Freddy's, and that's Endo One, who's getting a rework in the future. So I'll probably have to come back and redo him. But for time's sake, for for the time being, I'll still uh, touch up on him, and maybe this will be a historic video we could look back. Um, so with Endo One. You know, uh, you know, past characters, I'll talk about support. This guy needs a mask animatronic. So if we don't get a mask animatronic, all I could do is talk. Scenarios. Okay, we got one. <laughs> so you can only go left and right hall. You do suffer the red line door penalty. But when you, but unlike others that get sent back, uh, endo one only gets sent back up to here, depending on which hall. If, if you go down here, you'll be around there. If you go down here and you get shut down, You'll go around here. Another thing they don't tell you. Another tip. Well, as you can see, it's kind of slow. But if you can creep in, you can actually camp with Endo 1. So this guard was pretty baby. Babyish. You go into the office, but you don't go, you know. You go in so you don't get shut down by the door. But then you don't go all the way in to where you trigger your his kind of animation. But you can camp. They don't tell you that, but you can camp. But again, you need a mask. Okay, so we got but okay, we got two masks, three masks. Okay, so this is even better. It's really about timing, and this is probably, dare I say, the the most coordinated anima. Like you have to be coordinated with this animatronic. Maybe he's the most that needs that coordination. Okay, everyone's going here. I'm gonna. Uh, I guess I'll go this way. Don't know if we'll get a good example, depending if we get good guards. But uh, I'm trying to show you the camping example. So the only way you get the kill is if the guard has the mask on and you're in there. No, I used to be a real rock star. So if only this guy was a bit faster. So you see how I got sent back? I only get sent back here. So it's not too bad. But if there's no mask animatronics, there's no way unless the guard somehow does a mistake and they accidentally put their mask on when you're in there. But that's like... It's either super rare or the guard is uh, pretty babyish. Okay, I'll pressure. Will he close out on me? Looks like he will. That's pretty much it. When it comes to support, it's definitely your mask animatronics. Maybe, you know, I keep saying it and I'll say it again. Phantom BB, Phantom Puppet, because they distract the guard. Maybe the, they distract the guard from seeing left and right hall. So you could sneak in, camp there, and then uh, pursue whenever any other toy animatronic comes in. You don't want to wait till they get in and then you come because he's pretty slow. I guess that's why the creator made this guy able to... He's pretty much the only one able to camp. Let me see. You can't see the screen. See how... So you could, you, it was kind of hard to see, but if you if you do slow-mo on the YouTube video, you can kind of tell where you can camp. But we keep getting bad guards. But that's pretty much it for Endo 1. He needs a mask animatronic. That's probably why he's getting a rework. Same with Endo 2, and we'll get to him in the future. But that's it for Endo 1. Uh, he's pretty hard to get a kill, but... Hey, if you can make it work, there you go. Endo 1. That's it. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and now I'm going to move on to FNAF 2. And if you missed any of the other previous characters, want to try and learn some tips and tricks, or just if you're brand new and want to try and learn them, Hope you uh, hope the videos check out the videos. Hope they help you out. So if you guys like, comment, subscribe. See you in the future videos that come. Peace out.